It was uh, 152 apartments on a podium, uh, four stories of wood frame. The podium was roughly 30 feet high, and it was a, a unique job because getting material in and out of the building had to go through another builder's site, per se. So we reached out to get this hoist, thinking we had a small corner of a sidewalk that we could place this thing between the building and a city street. Uh, the small footprint, we were able to drop it on the sidewalk didn't take up much space. We didn't have to access the site because we were loading right off the street. With the wood frame structure, it was tough to, initially, we were going back and forth with our engineer to figure out how to attach a hoist to the side of the building. Originally, we had looked at hoists with higher capacities, and like I said earlier, the engineers were coming up with some pretty crazy attachment deals where we would have to tear drywall down inside, um, sister to new joists to allow tiebacks to connect further into the building. So we, uh, we called Safeway to determine what the best fit for our job was, and they brought the Betamax hoist to us um, with the lesser tieback um, forces. We were able to actually just lag bolt directly to a six inch thick LVL that was part of our band board system. And at all the natural connections inside the building to the trusses and to the walls above and below were enough to sustain the required forces. And their, their install was awesome, to say the least. They were safe and uh, cautious of their surrounings, cautious of the building. Just, it was a day up and a day down. We, we figured two days up, two days down, and they were in and out before, before we knew it. Well, they couldn't get enough of it. <laughs> they, um, they, they were appreciative of it because it was simple for them to use. It was really one guy on the ground with the remote and, and one guy helping him load the material on the ground and then maybe one guy upstairs unloading. So it, it minimized their labor costs to actually get material in and out of the building because it didn't require 10 guys carrying things up and down stairs or, or in and out of the building to get it to an interior elevator. Um, as the hoist was going away, it was actually very easy to put the building back together. There was no remedial work after we removed the hoist. Um, there was only four connections or five connections, I think, going up the side of the building. And the, the skin of the building was hardy panel, so it was simple enough to just I think four hours worth of work, pop four hardy panels back in where they were supposed to go, caulk them in, done. And the uh, the four balconies, we just put the four railings on and we were out. I'm already pushing for them to include a budget line for a similar material hoist on anything we have that's a single building or maybe two buildings that are, that are taller than usual or any kind of tight site.